Hi, I'd like to introduce you to the Vera Rubin Observatory in the 8.4 meter Saumonier Telescope. From its high altitude perch in the Atacama Desert, this stubby telescope can image the entire visible sky every three to four nights. This data is going to reveal never before seen details in the structure of our universe and help researchers map dark matter while showing us how dark energy shapes space over time. But we're the Planetary Science Institute, and all these galaxies are just noise to us. Very pretty noise. But it's the ice and rocks that get us excited. On Monday, Ruben gave us a first look at what it's capable of. With just 10 hours of observing, Ruben identified 2,104 new asteroids filling the space between us and the far edge of the asteroid belt. Over the next 10 years, Rubin should bring the number of known asteroids up to 5 million. If there is a dangerous asteroid out there eyeing Earth, Rubin should find it. And if there are distant planets out there beyond Neptune, Rubin will find those too. As part of its legacy survey of space and time, Rubin will identify everything that flickers, flares, and moves in the night. Sure, that means we will be catching millions of supernovae and maybe billions of variable stars. But it will also catch comet outbursts in the slow-motion orbits of distant dwarf planets. When our community makes new discoveries with this data, we'll bring them right here to you. So click that subscribe button and remember to go out and look up.